this is a video for setting up Google's API key for maps. One of the first things to do when you log into your WordPress dashboard is to come and check appearance. You'll see up here is a red dot with a white number in the middle and it means that there's an update. So we'll come down and check themes and there is indeed an update for Stefan. Click on theme details and update now. Okay, now for setting up the API key, go to theme jack biz, across to theme jack biz and click and come down this menu here and click on integration. Okay, and the top box is Google's API integration key. So reads, get your Google Map key from here, and you'll need to log into your Gmail account. Okay, so we're in Google's API dashboard. And come over to the top right corner and come down and click on create a project. I had already made something, so now it's got a name to it. And create. And you'll see now it's complete. The whirling has stopped and there's a number. And the first link we're going to click on is Google Maps JavaScript. Click on enable and then click on the back arrow and click on under Google Maps APIs click on more then click on Google Maps directions API click on enable and go back again and the next one is Google Maps geocoding API click on that enable and go back and the last one is Google Google Plus API. Enable and now click Go to Credentials. First drop down we're going to select Google Maps JavaScript and where will this be used? It will be used on a browser and then click on what credentials do I need. Browser key 1 enter your domain name followed by a backsplash and an asterisk now create API key and hit create API key again click done and here is your API key copy the key go to your site paste your key into the Google Map API and it's all done now let's go to footer and if you come to footer and there isn't a map module just click on add module map so we will begin the setup of the map module and we're going to enter I, for the map center address in map settings I set city state zip code and click find okay and the zoom area is the smaller the larger the number, the farther away the image is. So if you want to see more detail, you're going to make the number smaller. So I'll set zoom at, say, 12. Mouse wheel on. Zoom is 12 map height. I want this at 200. And I do not want the address boxes on. The address boxes are for if you have clients coming to your location, they can enter their address and your address and get directions. People are not coming to my location. Map height 200. Okay, now we'll add a new map pin. and here I will put the specific address and click find okay so now it's put a map pin in the specific location and I want to show the circle and the circle color I want light so I'll make it white 
The radius is 20 kilometers and one kilometer is about six tenths of a mile. Address box height 200 and we're done. Click on insert pin, save, save settings and I'll right click on the domain name at the top and click on open link in a new tab and here's our map and our map pin and we're done.